And he starts against Argentina. This is game nine from Pool C, and both these teams are in need of a win. Samoa yet to reach the last eight this season. Yeah, Samoa, they aren't far away though, Rupert. They'd be able to keep their poise in these games such as this, then they'll be a threat. But this Argentinian team, Santiago Gomez Cora, would have spoken about execution in this game. In the first one, they look very, very tired, very fatigued, and they weren't in it. Gaston Revolta get us started playing in his 57th event here in Singapore this weekend. There he is, the great man. What a servant he's been for Argentina Sevens over the year. And we're underway in this Pool C round two match between Argentina and Samoa. Knocked back on the Argentinian side, and here is Revolta. Running at the Samoan line, seems some space around the outside, hurls it in. And fortunately for Samoa, it was Alatasi Tupo who latches onto it. Having a sneak down the short side is Mia Loy. Pops it back to Ropati. Big rangy figure of Ropati with a tape round his head, but penalty Argentina. Great timing there by the Kenton revolvers, they go quickly. Here they come. The Puma Sevens. Javier Rojas. This is Nicolas Menendez, try scorer this morning. Fine. Philando Luna wrapped up by Selly Selly. They go the short side, Samoa. Having to come up with plenty of tackles here, and they've done well there to put Argentina over the sideline. Nearly caught them out, though, Argentina. They sent too many in that ruck. Because luckily, Bar was able to get out of there, there he is there on screen and make the covering tackle to force out the Argentinian play but look where they are deep within their own 22 uh, Samoa need to be accurate here on the throat Argentina a team who aren't afraid to kick what about Samoa, any chance they'll be uh, putting the boot to ball here Carl to get out of the danger zone, I think they win this they run no more there from Argentina, so Samara could just keep walking if they wanted to, but Selly Selly play scrum half. And as you said, Kaltanana, they will play out. Physical stuff here, as always, from Argentina in the close contact areas. Good run from Gordon Langkild. Here's Selly Selly, dummy left, and then he straightens it up. Looking for the turnover, is it all Hus? Can't get it. Gap opening that closes pretty quickly. Good offload off the floor to Toloa. Danger man for Samoa here. Here's Selly Selly. Still keeping it pretty tight here, Samoa. Not stretching That's themselves done. too far. Just wanting to hold possession, control the tempo, ask questions of this Argentinian defence. Alatasi Tupo now, the man who snuffed out that try early on and there was a try on there for Samoa but ruled forward says referee Joubert oh if Taloa is half a step back this is a try all day long it was a nice quick transfer from Tila Mialoy just caught a bit flat does the winger is two pole yeah it's forward but that guy there needs to be half a step back and it's a try time he scored 82 of them 83 now with his uh, try this morning, Samoa Taloa. Set. Needs no second invitation to head to the whitewash. Here come Argentina down the short side. Good little dart there from Revolver, captain. He's given it into Alvarez. And Alvarez, he's gone over the line. He thinks he's scored. Touchline okay? Yeah. And it's awarded. So heads up play from Gaston Revol. He's found Alvarez and Argentina strike first. Well, it's unusual from the scrum. You can see there just falls down. Does Len kill it out of the scrum. Gaston Revol takes full toll. Nice, nice pass on the inside. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful from the number six for Argentina. Great body control by Santiago Alvarez. Good start for Alvarez too. He's come in late for Matias Osadzuk into this Argentina 12. So. Perhaps didn't have all week to focus. He's come up with a fine finish there early in this pool C match. And that whole opportunity, Rupert, came from a forward pass from Samoa, who would have scored down the other end, would have been seven points to them. And that's a little moment that they're not winning at the moment. 
Argentina are good enough to take full toll and take the lead. 5-0, Argentina lead. Two-time event winners on the series, USA Sevens back in 2004 and 2009, Argentina. Samoa, of course, won the Paris Sevens in an epic final against Fiji a year ago. Of course, we head to Paris next for round nine. On this wonderful global event, the HSBC World Rugby Seven Series, that one's gone forward off the restart. It'll be a Samoan feed. Yeah, great competition in the year from both teams. But I wasn't getting up for Samoa, not quite sure who was up for Argentina. Tila Mieloy. So integral to Samoa's chances. They reinvented restart Samoa, didn't they? That team of 09 10 that won the series title. Lola Louis, Uwali Mai, Michele Pesamino, Fata Solida. Everyone's Six. caught up though, there, haven't they? They've all caught up. They all know how to do it now. Well, that's the thing. Everyone looks at each other so closely now. And as you said, Samoa changing the game. And everyone, every team copies them because it worked. Sure did. Those were the glory days of Samoa Sevens, that's for sure. And now under Sir Gordon Titchens trying to work their way back into top team contention here in Singapore. Good defence though again from Argentina and they have the advantage, but they will go quickly. And here they come looking for their second try. Flat ball pass and it's another one. And going over this try time is Bazan Velez. And Argentina showing Samoa how to take their chances here. Offensive defense from Argentina was the first try scorer. Santiago Alvarez absolutely dumps him. And then they put, put, put it out wide to Bazan Velez. He got on the outside, was never going to be stopped. Quite an inexperienced player, just his sixth event here, Bazan Velez, but he showed a good turn of pace there and an eye for the try line. Fine finish from the man from Cordoba. His Gaston Revol with a wide out attempt at the conversion. That one just slips by. Can't add to his significant point scoring tally. Alvarez just getting a bit of help there from the trend, like contact lens. Fine to continue. So Samoa need possession off this restart. Time's up on the clock for the first half. Argentina leading 10-0. Gaston Revol, you can be sure that he will put this right on a sixpence. One of the best in the business. And that's been Play knocked on. back again, but Samoa just latched onto it. It was Revol party who got on the floor quickly. They needed that. Can they make it pay? Show and go from Tupac. He gets off the floor, not held. Vaa, another strong tackle coming back. Let go, says the referee. Selly Selly gives a jersey of his opponent there, trying to force him back. Does well to get to ground. They got the penalty. You head to release here, Fernando Luna. Selly Selly goes quick. Looks for the offload. Can he find it? Yes, he can. It's a roll party. And Sabelio Ropati will give Samoa exactly what they needed. They are back in this round two contest in Pool C. Well, you spoke, spoke about the kickoff, which they duly won finally. Samoa, only the second time they've been in this area. A lot of players on the deck for Argentina. They sent way too many into that last run. Silly Silly realizes that they're short on numbers, just go straight down Main Street. And in the end, the backup from Sevilla Ropati. Is brilliant. Commits the pen to Selly Selly, doesn't he? Handy guy to have around. Difficult to bring down. Great openings for his teammates. Conversion is successful for Mieloy. So Samoa get it within three. They trail down the right hand corner. And that's the perfection, the direction they are running to here. Samoa left to right now in this second half. Brought down by Bazan Velez, a try scorer in the first half for Argentina. They are leading Samoa here by three points. Crucial game this for both teams. They both lost their opening matches this morning. <laughs> Little dart there from Franco Sabato. He decides to send a kick. We've seen this already today. He'll look to pick it up himself, and he's done that beautifully. 
Sabato. He's over the line. The only question is, has he grounded it cleanly? No way. Taylor Mialoy coming up with a try saver. A deserved try, that's for sure. We're going to have a look at it. I thought it was okay initially. At the time I blow my whistle, the ball is held up. We're looking by where there's a grounding initially. Got you, Craig. We're looking for an initial On field call is no try. Held up. Looking for some evidence that he might have got it down. Oh, you don't miss a trick, man. Shoot there. Look at him here. Taylor Mialoy targets the ball. Not down. Still up. Second man comes in. No try. Maybe he should be a referee, Kaltanana. Craig, Way too much yeah, there is no grounding. So okay. no try. Yep. Held up. Thank you. Poor hold up. Five held up it is. So Argentina miss out on one there through Sabato, but they will have the scrum feed five metres out. So Samoa not out of jail yet by any means. Watch the revolt at the base of the scrum. You can see Javier Fine. Rojas has gone to the right-hand side just to draw over the defender. So what that does opens up the left-hand side. Here come Argentina. Leading by three. Looking to extend that to two scores. That's good feet. Again from Bazan Vélez. No, what? Roll away, says the referee. Five metres out here, Argentina. And going low and through are the Puma Sevens, but it's spewed out. Who's got it? It's number four, Menendez. Number five, please. So penalty coming Argentina's way. Could be a, another sanction here. Cynical infringement, one metre from your goal line, Ben. Yellow card it Cynical. is. Just hold that, please. And that just makes life more difficult for Samoa on their own line. It's Sabelio Ropati. Yes. Scored a try just before the break. And he'll sit down for two minutes, seven on six. Here come Argentina. Revol shows and goes and reaches out. And the skipper is over for Argentina. That's a fine finish from their most experienced player on the circuit. And he's cracked the big 4-0 as well. What you see here, if you're able to keep your composure, you see the way they use their great footwork to draw in defenders, and Gaston Revol finds a little crack on the defence with the inside pass. He fakes to go wide, double pumps, and then realises the defence has turned its back. What a pace to score, run under the horns as well. He'll convert his own. So Argentina... 17-7 now, two-score lead over Samoa. There's Santiago Gomez corner. Argentina head coach, what a player he was. Now third on the all-time record try-scoring charts. Uh, he recently been overtaken by Collins and Jira, and then Dan Norton. What a fine job he's doing with this. Argentina 7-7, which has a good blend of experience and youth at the moment. And that's a restart that went over the top of the Samoan catches and it almost fell into the hands of the on-running Puma Chaser and that would have been another try. Yeah, Renzo Barbier, it was. I think he was thinking about his try celebration. He did everything but scored. He absolutely muffed it. Went right through his hands. I'm not sure he's going to look at his captain for a few minutes. Crouch. Fine. So, 17-7, plenty of time left in this one, three and a half minutes, an eternity in sevens, Samoa, have some space in front of them here, here's Tua Tungaloa on debut for Samoa this weekend, runs it out, but that ball's gone to floor and it's been hacked through, there has been a knock-on so they'll come back, Argentina feed, we'll just pile on pressure, on themselves a Samoa. Danny Case comes on, he just needs to hold this ball and reset and try and not leak any more points. That nine, he said. More changes for Samoa. Yep. Coming on the field is Tomasi Alosio, Sorry, number eight uh, shirt, yeah, to oh, yeah. take up a position just to the left of this. Okay, we're we good to go, confirm. Yeah, Amanda Motunga's out there in the number three shirt, playing on the tight head Crouch. side of the scrum. Fine. And Danny Kays, as you mentioned, is hooker. Set. So, fresh legs, can they do it for Samoa? But they've got to defend here now, they need to get the ball back. Two and a half minutes to go. Quick hands. 
from Argentina and round the outside goes Sabato. Missed out on one earlier. Alvarez. Play on. Alvarez on the loop. Running slightly across field. No problem for the Samoan on defense that right. time. And it's gone forward. So a chance here now for Samoa to run it out from their own line. Taloa. Vaa at scrum half. To a tongue lower. Across to Kays. Kays sets it up. They've got the penalty. And they go quickly. Most of their players on the near side here. Vaa goes the other way. And all oh, good one on one defense from Argentina. And look at that. It's almost been turned over. Wreaking havoc at the breakdown here, the Puma Sevens. And that's the end product. Yeah. This is an area where they really do excel through the Pumas, and it looks like Rafaele Vaad's gone down. Yeah, looks like a league complaint, too. Furious, furious counter rocking, wasn't yeah, it? And they're, they're so good at it, Argentina. They make every moment yeah, count. Yeah. It's not always pretty, but it's really effective. It's all about timing too, and getting your body position right, being explosive. And that's where they're really good. Always has been throughout Puma rugby, where they're sevens or fifteens. Just so good in the area. Love a bit of contact using the shoulders. So if you're not right, not clean, correct, then look out. The change being made for Argentina as we set this scrum. They really have got a pathway going from sevens to fifteens in Argentina. Names like Tukalet, Cordero, Axel Muller's playing for Toulon at the moment in the top 14 in France. Juan Emoffs played sevens. It's not nice to see Lafaeli Baha going off with a leg injury, it looks like. We wish him the best. We will restart play here. Crouch. Time ticking down. Minute Fine. 15 to go, 17-7, Argentina Six. leads Samoa in control of this Pool C match. Attacking opportunity for Argentina. Winning the ball at the breakdown with ease. Here they go again. And sneaking through once more was Belotto. Can't quite make it, being held up by Samoa. They go the short side. Reaching out. Lost forward. Lost no, forward, no, says the referee. The Felipe away. Del Mestre Take just unable away. to put that one down. They'll go back for the penalty. Yeah, great defense here from Samuel coming up in the line. Just a little poke. Not the death by Samuel knocking that on. Well, they really have put the screws on Argentina here. Samuel needs to score twice. 20 seconds left. Argentina drifting to the near side, little dummy and go there from German Schultz. And here's Luna, Fernando Luna. That one's gone forward again. Slippery conditions here in the humidity. And Samoa will have a chance to set a scrum five meters out, but with time up on the clock, it's probably going to be too late. The defenders very, very well, especially in the second half, have Samoa, but they just haven't had. Enough opportunities with ball and hand going forward. So a couple of mistakes, a couple of mishandles, and they haven't been able to get out of their own 22 for the majority yeah. of the second seven. That was that key moment, wasn't there, Carl, in the first half you mentioned? Samoa Taloa, forward pass, just got in front of the man. Just Nail that under sure the post. Know, Score first in this game. It could have been oh so different. That's the thing, I think they've really grown their confidence. It seemed like one of those sides that are able to score first on anyone when they really are tough to break. The Samoa team they already showed defensively very good. Offensively, just need to get a bit Fine. more polish. Set. So as you can see, we're into added time here in this Pool C match. Argentina 17-7 over Samoa. It's gone forward. And, okay. Well, perhaps that's symptomatic of Samoa's fortunes in this match. They have gone 0 for 2 here on day one in Singapore. But Argentina have their first win of the day. They are up and running. They've beaten Samoa by 17 points to seven.